I'd like to show you how to work with something called next style in paragraph styles. This can be really helpful if you're typing in text or if you have text on the page. I'm going to show you something really cool with that. So what I want to do is come out here and start typing. So I'm going to type in a headline. Now, if you work with paragraph styles, you'll see my paragraph styles panel over here. You'll see that we have obviously the ability to create lots of styles. If you apply a style to text and then you hit return, typically what's going to happen in that text is it's going to keep the same paragraph style. It's called the next style. The next style is the same style. Now what you can do, let me undo here, is as you're typing, you can make it so that if you press return, it switches styles to another style. So think about this. If you're going to have a headline, the next thing you'll probably have is either a subhead or body copy. So what you can do is come to headline here. Let's say a style you have. Double click or right click and edit it. Come to next style and you'll see that we can choose a style we've already created. Next style literally means that if you start typing your paragraph, hit a return, it'll switch to this next style. Now, if you don't have a style created already, you can choose new paragraph style and make yourself a new style right now. But I'll choose body. I've created it already. I'll click OK. And I'll hit return. Now, you got to hit return here and start typing. And you'll see it applies the body style. You can see it switched right there. Now, this is pretty cool. Now, if I hit return again, it's just going to continue with the body style. Now, let's suppose that I type in another headline and I've got some other text, text like this. And let's suppose that I do something like this. Let me go back to basic paragraph formatting. I've got several headlines in here. And what I'd like to do is I'd like to apply the headline and the next after it. So if I select headline and the next paragraph, what you can do is you can come to headline. Instead of clicking on it to apply it, you can right click on headline and choose apply headline then next style. So you don't have to type to do this. So I'll just apply it. It'll automatically do what it says. I can go to headline, do the same thing, right click, apply, next style. Now, let me set it all back to basic paragraph. If you take a look, if I select, let's say, these four paragraphs, come to headline right here, right click, and choose the same thing, you'll see that'll work as well. So it just depends on what you're doing. If it's one paragraph, uh, two paragraphs rather, or four or ten, it doesn't really matter. It will apply headline to the first one selected, and then the rest will get the body treatment. So that's kind of a cool little tip for working with paragraph styles to be able to apply them, especially if you're typing in text to make it easy on yourself to apply headlines, subheads, and body copy.